Hey YouTube, Shaybear1000 here again. Today we're going to be finding out why the horn don't work on this scooter right here. Stay tuned, let's see if we can fix it together. Okay guys, the horn, I mentioned in one of my other videos, the horn worked. Well, it did work, but it's not working now. But, it is making a noise. Let's put you down here real close, see if you can hear it or not. I don't know if you could hear that, but it's making a little noise, so it's getting juice to it. So let's figure out why Nothing's happening on it. Okay. Ours, uh, just gotta pull this thing off. Pull out a couple screws on the back side here. Alright guys, we got down to the horn. There's the flasher. Right here's the horn. There's an adjustment right here on the back side of this. That screw right there. That will adjust your horn. Let me see if I can get you. right here so it's a little it's a Phillips and a little tiny nut there and you can loosen that and see this vibrates back and forth and rattles up against here and when you put when you uh come on now Now it's not even clicking. But that's how you just like how loud and everything like that. Let's see. There it's clicking. So let's try to adjust that and see what we can do with it. I don't think I'm going to have to take it off. But we'll see. I'm going to have to get one of my short screwdrivers here. Want to screw this? Uh, this nut seems to be. I know you're zoomed in. Seems to be on there pretty tight, so we're gonna loosen this nut up so we can get an adjustment on that horn. And then we'll tighten it back down once we get our adjustment. So that should be good. <laughs> Thank you. 
But a lot of times you can get these things working if you hear that little clicking noise in them. Nine times out of ten, you can get them to work. Alright, we're getting somewhere. That's all there is to it, really. If you can hear it clicking, first thing is make sure this is not, you know, rusted up or anything. If it's not, then try to pull that screw clear out, do some adjusting on it, and then go from there. Maybe oil it up, won't hurt a thing. But I know this one worked not that long ago, so I knew it wasn't going to be too bad. Just a real simple fix. Thought I'd share with you because a lot of guys will go buy a new horn. And they're not very expensive, I mean, but still, if you spend 10 to 20 bucks on a horn that you don't have to, you know, I mean, and you, you got some time, just a little bit of know-how, there you go. Turn signal's working. Alright, cool. Alright, so there's a quick upload for you guys, just something simple. Um... I thought it was actually going to take a little longer. I thought I was going to have to take the, the horn off and uh, soak it in some penetrating fluid or something. But uh, that wasn't the case. Like I said, it worked out not that long ago. And, you know, the other day it when I, I actually said everything works, the horn works. And I thought, well, I better go check that after I cut from the video. I went and checked it and it was just clicking. So There you go, guys. So another quick fix on one of these little scooters but the horn itself is on the same basis as any horn on pretty much any any automobile that, that's got a horn that's like this you know I mean if you can listen and you can hear it clicking inside there then then, then it can probably probably fix nine, be fixed nine times out of ten because that means you're getting juice to it it's something inside here and usually it's something simple like that so um, alright there you go. I'm going to tighten that nut up and throw this thing back together. I won't bore you with that, but I will say Shea Bear, uh, the myth, the man, the legend. Thanks for watching, guys. And I'm gone for now. Bye-bye.